hey lovies thank you for coming back thank you for clicking on this video um if this is your first time here please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and hit the little bell button to notify you when i'm dropping in another flame ass video um so today we're doing another unboxing but it's gonna be a little bit different it's not a subscription box it's not like something random it is something that i love dearly it's makeup pat mcgrath um she had a sale it wasn't like a big sale okay um some of her lipsticks were ten dollars and like we all know that pat mcgrath is like the holy grail of makeup you know it's expensive it's luxurious it's it's up there with the chanel up there with the nars and like she's just well respected in fact that she's a black woman on top of that i had to support i've always wanted to buy something from pat mcgrath but like the price especially when you're broke yana you're just like i cannot justify spending 80 something dollars on a palette like 50 i could give you 60 even maybe but like 80 90 dollars i'd be like <sighs> especially when you're not making a lot like i said i've been on brokiana for a while so but you know um there was a sale on some of the lipsticks that were like they were ten dollars instead of the usual like twenty or thirty dollars i thought was amazing so i had a cop a few because we love pat mcgrath like First of all, she had Naomi Campbell as like the face of her brand when she like dropped. And I'm like, if you can afford Naomi motherfucking Campbell, Naomi, like I was like, I knew she was legit. So we love Pat McGrath here. And this is the box came in. Um, shipping was delayed because it was like, like I said, everyone was harassed. I saw it on Twitter and some girl was like, y'all need to drop what y'all doing and copy some lipstick from Pat McGrath if you already have it. And I don't think shipping was that bad. I think I got two or three. Um, anyway, so I kept my lips really neutral for this video because I want to see what y'all and this is basically like a Kylie lip gloss which is basically just like glorified beauty supply store lip gloss so like this is what my lips look like with no lip liner no nothing okay this is what the box looks like nothing special in terms of like um design on the box which is great because people be stealing gifts and shit so and it's this Pat, Pat McGrath lab like a bunch of confetti which is cute kind of messy but like cute nonetheless and then i think this is just the packing label i only got two things i got the lux trans lipsticks exotica and in the shade exotica which is a violet based burgundy and then i got the lux trans lipstick she's so deep which is a burgundy brown and i've been told y'all on this webs on this channel your girl loves a good brown lipstick it's just mm, it's very 90s and i love all things 90s inspired fashion wise so i mean i feel like they did a lot for like two lipsticks but like i, I guess you know when you're pat mcgrath you do what you want oh i forgot how pretty the packaging was okay so this is what the uh, Lux trans lipsticks looks like and i already said their names but the it's four grams 0.14 ounces or is it 0.4 okay i'll leave all that down below on the screen look how pretty that is okay we're gonna unravel it oh wow oh and it's opening like that that's so cute i am so impressed i can't believe that i own pat mcgrath lipstick like i'm literally just shook and then I'm gonna eventually so like I said this is she so deep which is a burgundy brown this is how much product you get which isn't really bad for ten dollars and then they have like little lips which I I love attention to detail I love attention to packaging it just it speaks to my Virgo moon tendencies I'm just I love stuff like that so okay ooh very smooth formula okay no distinct smell and it very much is a true burgundy brown yes um i'm here for this like i said i only got two colors because you know broke me on the things and like the colors soaked out super duper fast like i literally feel like you blinked and like they were i I feel like it was a whole range of colors and i just got the ones that i knew would look good on me i feel like i'm not even gonna need no lip liner with these because like this 
you know, it just feels luxurious. I don't know, it's just so pretty. The ellipses, I think, is very comparable to them. Probably like um, a YSL lipstick. Yeah. And then once again, this is another lipstick that I got. Cut my grab. Did that. We're opening. Uh, this came inside of it. I in the shade Exotica. If it could focus, that'd be great. I don't think it focused, but I'll put it on the screen because we're all about sharing information. Yeah, this is really pretty. I think I'm going to keep the original packaging. And this is Exotica, which is a burgundy red. Ooh, look at that. Again, this is how much product you get. Ooh, Chile! Ooh, this is so pretty. Oh, okay. Okay, it glide on so smooth. Look at that. I don't know. Just, I'm sorry. Look how beautiful that is. Like, yeah, it's Pat McGrath. Like, I'm sold. I want more. And, okay. We're gonna be right back. I'm gonna show the two colors on my skin tone with no lip liner, no added products. Be right back. Okay, so right now on my lips, I have Exotica, which is a very vibrant, beautiful. Let me double check. I think Exotica. Bam. Exotica is a violet based burgundy. Um, it feels very reminiscent of like Night Moth or. But I love the color payoff. I feel like I had to do just one swipe in order for the color to appear on my lips. It glides on really smoothly. Then again, my lips are not like dry or crusty. So like, that's another thing. Tell, isn't this so like beautiful? I love it. Um, definitely a really great fall color, great winter color. I'm definitely one of those people who would wear this burgundy color year round. That's just me. So five out of five for this. She's killing it, but we already knew that. Okay, so now I have on my lips, um, She's So Deep, 431. And like I said, it's a burgundy brown color, and it is it is everything. It reminds me of Chestnut, the lip liner. I'm not sure if MAC ever made Chestnut into a lipstick, but like, it just feels very reminiscent of Chestnut, and Chestnut was like my favorite, 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 favorite lip liner, and I use that thing until I got this small. But anyway, it feels wonderful um it's like that i don't want to say it's completely mad it's not like completely uh like glossy not it wouldn't be glossy but like a sheen it just feels very like there's a little bit of dimension in my lips with these lipsticks and like i love them both <laughs> this color is going to be my go-to right now like i can already feel it and i paid ten dollars for both of these bad boys like they're so gorgeous slide on beautifully i have no real complaints the website is beautiful of course aesthetically pleasing um she currently has the motherboard eyeshadow palette that's currently on the website um yeah love them would recommend them you know i follow a lot of black makeup twitter threads so whenever someone drops a sale <laughs> I'll be on it. Um, I'm feeling myself a little too hard with this, with this unit, with these lashes. And I'm feeling myself. You're like, you literally cannot tell me nothing. Period. Period. You can't tell me nothing with these, with this lip color on right now. Fierce. She's fierce. She's cute. Okay, anyway. That was my unboxing slash swatch slash try on slash review overall pat mcgrath is worth every dollar every cent we support black women we support black women in makeup and when we can because sometimes you can't go broke trying to support everybody okay but um i love them they're just so gorgeous the packaging is super beautiful can't complain but that is it thank you for watching this video thank you for clicking it please give it a thumbs up and subscribe there is more content coming your way Period. Anyway, stay blessed, moisturize your elbows, and stay beautiful. Mm -mm. That was a definitive statement. Stay beautiful. Bye, loveies.